Be strong and courageous. Do not fear or be in dread of them, for it is the Lord your God who goes with you. He will not leave you or forsake you. That's in Deuteronomy 31.6. Jesus began speaking, So many sorrows and so many troubles have swept over the people of earth. It is truly tragic at this time in earth's history. I know how you feel, Claire, but there are so many horrible things transpiring on earth right now. Try not to get too caught up in your own issues. He was saying this because it has been stormy. He continued, As things heat up in the world, your everyday issues will become more and more insignificant. I want you all to be ready to lay down your petty differences to embrace the truly wounded and hurting in this world. Children under instruction, you cannot help me with others if you are all caught up in your own petty dramas. I want you to focus on the seriousness of the world situation and prepare yourselves to help people cope. Everything from demon aliens to war on your soil, which is soon to come. Limit your time on the internet, but stay connected. Keep track of what is going on, but do not soak in it. You do, however, need to know how things are shaping up. Lord, I see Zelensky was shunned at a NATO meeting. What does this mean? It means he is on his own. Truly, he is just a puppet in this game. I love you dearly, but still I must rein you in sometimes, so you do not become a danger to yourself and others. He has been very evasive with me lately, and that makes me sad and insecure. Jesus continued, Meekness is the key quality I am looking for and wanting to develop in you. You are coming along, beloved, but try even harder to be meek. I miss you. I want to hold you and hug you and just keep your head upon my heart. So please cleave to that secure knowledge when I am not speaking to you directly. Hold firm to that understanding and let nothing dissuade you from that truth. A lot of this will be over soon. Please keep your eyes on my people and their needs as you navigate rough waters. The situation is dire. The attack on your country is imminent. This is not just posturing. It is the real thing. Just the way a bear circles you looking for the vulnerable spot. So real is this situation. You remember I showed you North Koreans landing on the eastern shore of Florida? Stealth, by night, penetrating your country? And that is not even to bring up the many cells that are poised for this attack. It is a powder keg, and one match could set off the whole thing. Right now it is a game of tiptoeing around the inevitable possibilities. Your country is very vulnerable on the eastern coastline. Many munitions and operations proceed from that area. It is like the first wall of defense. Right now, it is almost like a game of cat and mouse. Prayer will avail much. I love you tenderly. Stop questioning my love for you and take your medicine like a big girl. Things are converging, earthquakes, wars and rumors, asteroids and demon aliens. Yes, do put up that video again. Here he means the video on demon aliens. And that was the end of the Lord's message. Ezekiel has been seeing in vision India and sharks getting so aggressive 
they actually come up on the shoreline and pull people into the water. Tiger attacks are also increasing. All the animals are becoming extremely aggressive and killing humans. I wonder if dark matter has been unleashed in the area to reduce the population? Dear Hindu people, please stop murdering Christians and call on Jesus to save you from being devoured by the animals. Give him your life and forsake your many gods who are demons masquerading as good guys but they do nothing when your life is in danger. Jesus Christ is your only hope, and despite how you have persecuted and murdered Christians, He still loves you and will save you if you call upon Him with a sincere heart in repentance for the evil you have done. He loves you, bottom line, and He does not want to see you devoured by these creatures. God bless you, dear heart dwellers, and thank you for your prayers and intercession for the unsaved souls.